Hey, everybody. Howdy. Thank you so much for joining us for today's in-store signing session with uh, touring professionals, AJ Risley here. Oh. And Grady wow. Shoe here. Hey. Look at these guys. Uh, my name's Robert McCall. I'm going to be uh, kind of yes. fielding some questions. Thank you very much. Yeah. I'm going to be fielding some questions for us via the live chat. So if you have a question for one of these guys, uh, drop it in there, and I'll try to get it answered for you. In the meantime, they're going to be signing discs that you've ordered of theirs and uh, I guess of just any mold, really. Um, so if you have not already ordered one of these guys, Tour Series Discs or something else from the website, go online to dynamicdiscs.com and place that order. And then once you've done that, you can put in the order comments that you'd like to have. AJ, Grady, Paige Burkus is over here signing stuff on her own. Um, Drop in the order comments that you'd like them to sign that, and they will get that taken care of for you. So um, I'm going to start moving these down the table. This says AJ Signature, please, so that means you should sign that. Oh, that's me. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, I know, Brian. And let me get to uh, yeah, new stamp a lot. Let me get to the live chat same, here, and we'll get stamp. rolling. Yeah. It doesn't even say 2019 on it. I know. <laughs> yeah. Alexis says, is it too late for me to order a couple of Risley Waffle Wardens and have him sign them? Well... Normally, no, because he will be able to sign anything that's ordered before 3 p.m. Central. Uh, but I'm pretty sure the Wardens are sold out. You hate to see it, but also you love to see it. So, uh, Oh, let me get a, uh, let me get an empty sleeve to put that in. So, Okay. Hold on. I'm just going to sign all of it. I'm just going to sign everything. <laughs> sign it twice. Sign it twice. It's like it came just out of my bag. How are we doing, Bobby? Where are we? Where are we? Uh, where are you pushing us out? Facebook, Instagram, this is on YouTube. YouTube? Okay, cool. All right, so oh hey, I hand see those it. to Gary and have him put those in the uh, in the box there. there Steven says AJ there. Waffle Warden is the bomb. Boom, boom. Please have AJ Rizzoli. Grady Shoe, Eric McCabe, and Paige signed the, the disc. Ooh. I will pick it up at the store on Tuesday. Dang. Y will he, though? I, I guess we'll find out. Or give it to will right, So you sign Angela. it. We'll get Grady to sign it, and then we'll just set it aside for everybody else. Um, Dustin says, dang, I already ordered my Opto X compasses. Didn't know Grady was going to be there to sign them. Sweet. Well, now you know, oh, Dustin. Now, yeah. But you know what hey, you Dustin, can do, and I know this anyway. is... I know this is kind of a crazy solution, but you I can welcome. actually order two more OptoX compasses for Grady to sign. That's all, yeah, that's always possible. Okay, please. Uh, Caleb says, are those sweet <laughs> GBO hoodies available? Uh, yeah, they are. They are. In store, GBO week. Yes. yes. Are they available online? Are these, uh, hey, Jackie? Yes. Are these available online as well? Mm. Those, the yes. the sublimated hoodies? Sweet. Yes. Sweet. If you go to dynamicdiscs.com, you can check out these GBO sublimated hoodies that uh, Grady and AJ have been so kind to model for us. Um, I mean, they're looking good, too. You know, looking, what? yeah, I mean, they, they, they're looking good they're just, to quite good. They're just great. You know, you can, you've got a hood, and you can either put the hood up. Oh, wow. Or you can... Look how, look how versatile. You know, or you could put the hood down. Yep. Or you could put the hood, like, halfway, like... You can't really put it halfway. Hood technology has down, only please. come so far. <laughs> That's true. What There's, situations do you have your hood up and hood down? Uh, let me let me sign and then I'll. <laughs> is that from you the? You think on that? No, that's not that's not a YouTube question. That's just a Grady yeah, question. Yeah, that's just me. Uh, Derek says I ordered mine at eleven and didn't know about the signing. Could AJ and Robert sign mine? Okay, Derek, if you will. Um, right. Well. Cool. Wait, Oh, if we cool. happen to see yours, we will definitely sign them. One. If we don't... Okay. Oh, is this all just the same guy? Yeah, it is. Yeah. yeah he so didn't ask for your him. signature, but uh, just yeah. blow his mind. Give him your signature right. anyway. Uh, you might not do that. No? If they don't ask for it, then you probably shouldn't sign it. Okay, that's fair. Because if it comes inked, then they might be mad. And Sorry. Okay. Sorry, Andrew. It's a thrower. Ask for a signature. He's up AJ Simon Wardens. Okay. Uh, what hat is AJ wearing? Seth asks. Ooh. Uh, Thank you, Seth. I think it's a camo hat. Thank you, no way I'm not sure if we still have them on the website, but we do have a lot of hats on the website. So once again, go to dynamicdisc.com to check that out. Um, oh, he ordered them. Dang, multiple. Music and disc golf asks, how long have AJ and Grady been playing? Uh, I've been playing since 2014, so nice. close to six years now. Sweet. I've been playing since the beginning of 2004, 
15 years. Sweet. About, about like all of my life since I'm like, what? I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, Those are sweet. Seagraves Outdoors yeah. says, are y'all really out of the waffles? I think we are really out of the waffles. Go. Um, if you- uh, That's a hard job. If we are not able to replenish by the time uh, by the time you're ordering again, we have, uh, you might check a local retailer of yours. Um, a lot of them have bought some of these, so you might be able to get them from there. Uh, and then if you're not able to get one this time, we do plan on replenishing these throughout the year. So check those out. Uh, Inflight says, can Grady sign one of my compasses? Didn't know Grady was going to be there. Inflight, if you'll tell us what your uh, actual name is and your order number, we'll, we will do our best to try and get to it, but I can't guarantee that that's going to happen. We'll try our best. So. We will try our best. Uh, Mike says, to practice putting, is it necessary to have a basket or can you use something else? What do you guys think about that? One of the uh, Well, here's the thing. You either have to have a basket or you have to have a very vivid sense of imagination. <laughs> Basket or imagination works. You can, like I've seen people put into like laundry hampers, you know, some, anything that kind of like resembles uh, the target zone where you're trying to hit, mm -hmm. you know? So, but yeah, you gotta be able to visualize if you're gonna practice putt without a basket. Yeah, personally, if I was gonna practice without a basket, I'd probably get like the smallest target I could possibly get and try to hit it. Yeah, just like a, a pole. Like yeah. a light pole or something. Uh -huh. You could always do that. I mean, that's actually that's that's how the game started. Was object golf, mm -hmm. light poles and trees. You know, just find you know find a pole and then <laughs> and then pick a target zone where the sweet spot on the chains would typically be and mm -hmm. go for that. Go for yeah. that. Please uh, sign my desk, AJ. Peter says, "Grady Shoe, loving the Opto X Compass." Awesome. I'm glad you do. I like nice. that a lot too. It's nice. I threw it for the first time today, and it really? was it was great. I, well, uh, yeah, I didn't. I don't think I had a chance to throw them at the memorial. What would you compare it to? Said um, that's my order. Please sign. Would, Maybe he was talking about the compasses. Go ahead. It's it's uh, it's almost like a it almost flew like a bard, but just very uh -huh. flat, almost like puddle top. Mm -hmm. It was nice. I threw it a lot at the memorial. I remember. On um, fountain and this stuff. Okay, yeah. Leave that for a second. I'll ask. But you can put this one in there. Okay. Jeez. All right. In flight. If you are Andrew, please say that. Oh please. yes. Okay. So oh. that's right. So please sign those two OptoX. Both of them. Come. Yes, sir. Please. Bang. Okay. Uh, Daniel says, AJ, I learned your dad was a Seminole during the Open at Tallahassee this year. He yep. said you're a fan too. You should come play next year. The any, Open any at plans Tallahassee. Any to get to uh, Tallahassee next year? Possibly, yeah. Uh, the the only reason that I didn't go this year was just just because of the location and the drive time. You know, I'm, I was we were in Texas, and the options were either stay in Texas or drive all the way down to Florida. And it's a lot longer drive to drive all the way down to Florida. If I if I can lock down that private jet sponsor this year, then I'm all over it. Nice. And also, go Knowles. Do you, uh, do you have a private jet sponsor in the works? Uh, no comment. <laughs> All right. yeah, play, it, play it close to the vest. Yeah, that's, class, <laughs> that's classified. Okay. Actually, was, I actually was meaning to talk to you about that because I wanted to see if there was any like conflict of interest. That yeah. Um, well, we have our own private jets, so yes, it would be a conflict of right. interest. But for this one time, I would make an exception. Okay. There you go. See you at the Open at Tallahassee next year. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's see. the worst J I've ever <laughs> Jade. It's okay, man. One of a kind. Is that an A? That's oh, that's just a bad signature right there. It's okay, I'm man. So, I'm sorry, Tony. <laughs> At least he doesn't have a pattern to see how it. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, darn man. it. All Is right. That your signature from last year? Let's keep it yeah. moving. We got. <laughs> Derek says Robert and AJ are the warden goats. Ooh. Goats, like as in greatest of all time, or just like the ones that bring the whole team down? Well, I think Hashtag team judge. <laughs> like, Whoa, get I, would, I would just like to uh, <clears throat> just make a comment, please. <laughs> Both of these as well. Indeed. Too popular. <laughs> all right. What's up? Yeah, no, toss it in here. That's perfect. Toss three it. Or just these Can I have both of them signed by AJ, please? Thanks, you guys rock. Team Warden question for the stream, if possible. Wow, this is interesting. Okay, yeah, you hit a him question with. in the in the order comments from Kyle. 
Uh, AJ, do you have plans to attend the Music City Open this August in Nashville? Not, no, I don't. I think I put that on my, my tentative schedule as like an option for, for one of those weekends. Um, I can't remember exactly which week, weekend that, that tournament was, but I believe I had another tournament picked out. Sorry, Kyle. Thanks for buying these discs. Here, sign this real quick and then do that. Ah. All right, let's keep it moving. Jeremy says, was there a heads up that this disc signing was coming? Jeremy, there was. You need to follow the Dynamic Discs Facebook page. That's where we post uh, when we have in-store signings, Ooh, things like that. Yes. You can also follow the Dynamic Discs Emporia Facebook page. That is a page uh, specifically dedicated to the retail store here in Emporia. So they talk about you know some online stock and things like that as well. So check those out. And... You can also uh, you can also follow me and Grady on Facebook and Instagram. We were we tried our best to uh, promote this event mm -hmm. right now in advance. Yeah, what are y'all's handles on Instagram? Mine's at Grady Shoe. That's wow, that pretty, must be pretty, nice. Nice, very very easy. Wow, that one wasn't that one wasn't taken. Nope. <laughs> nice. It's dumb. I have a unique name. I like it. Uh, mine is Rizby Junior. R I Z B E E. R I Z B E E J R. I didn't promote it on my Instagram, but just in case you want to follow me instead, um, mine is J. Robert McCall. Interesting story that goes along with your handle, Grady. I um, uh, I went looking for just Robert McCall. The guy who owns it has two posts from like 2011 and seven followers, and it infuriates me that he still holds onto that handle. So anyway, whatever guy. He's a real guy. There you go, AJ. All right. James says, any more Raiders? Yes, there are more Raiders. I think Bobby's probably taking our camera. But we do have more Raiders in, available in lots of weights and plastics. Oh, so let's try that again. Lots of weights, only one plastic. Online at dynamicdiscs.com. Check those out, please. Uh, Tim says, when packing snacks for a tournament and casual round, I'll pick up to, I will pick three to four McChickens. Do you think that's too much, or should I just go with the normal snack foods? <laughs> Three to four. Three to four McChickens. Right. So what? What? What's the? What's the difference between three and four? Is it like the the footage of the course? <laughs> it's like mm, if the yeah, if the course is more than seventy five hundred feet long, I go with four McChickens. Uh, no, yeah. it's not too much. You can never have too many McChickens. My question is follow up question. Regular McChickens or hot and spicy McChickens? Dude, there is only one answer to that, and it's spicy McChickens. <laughs> yes. Thank you, bro. That you, is the you order answer. plain or with mayo, though? I, I stick with mayo. I like mayo. Well, yeah, I go with the mayo. I always like it without mayo. They always put too much on for me. Hashtag Team Waffle. If AJ is available, a signature would be awesome. Otherwise, a high five the next time he rolls through. Thank you. How about both? How about... So, yeah, hit both of those chill, real quick. Joseph. Chill. Just Let's push. see. I'm unable to find the Waffle Wardens. That's because they are sold out. Sorry. Sorry. A little bit behind. Um, all right, Steven, I'm going to be looking for... Hello. I'm going to be looking for oh, hey, your Bobby. order. If I happen to see it, I will make sure these guys sign it. Uh, Joe asks, Grady, how is Paige's van coming along? Oh, gosh. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's that's, still coming. That's going to that's gonna be a rip in the chat. I'm yeah. Sorry. It's Sorry, st Paige. Still coming. Uh, we finally got confirmation that they're working on it right now. So they said they'd give us an update next Tuesday on when exactly it'd be finished. Hopefully by next Tuesday. That's just a real bummer. Like I, yeah. You don't just, love it. No. You hate to. Oh, you hate to see you something hate, like you that. You hate to see it. Uh, tell tell everybody what happened. Just a brief summary. Yeah. So me and Paige were in Savannah, Georgia, at a hotel, and. Uh, it was a fancy hotel, so the valet oh. told us to, uh, you know, give him the van. So we said, don't park it inside because the van's too tall. And he tries to park it inside anyway and messes up the top of the van. And it's been getting fixed at almost ever since. And that was like four weeks ago. I mean, that's like pretty crappy. Yeah. You hate to see it. Yep. It's pretty dumb. R.I.P. Carter yeah, says, I hope the messed up Jay is mine. We'll never know. Too late. You'll, yeah, you'll just have to wait and see. It's not, though. Steven, Steven, thank you for your support. What? Oh, that one? This that one, that one and Steven this says, one. Sound Can you sign this one, Bobby? No sound effects or Robert would yeah. run, and that's correct. I, I would be out of here. What is this? 
Harp. Can you also post on Instagram because I refuse to use, he said face plant. We do post on Instagram. There but we go. did post on Instagram. Face plant? Or, or I don't know that I posted time. this. But, I, but, we, but do, we do, yeah. Follow. But do follow us on there as well. I assume you do based on the way that you. Face plant? Out. Mike says Who burgers says? or wings. Uh, How's that one? Oh, um, burger flavored wings. Okay, <laughs> first of all, that's disgusting. I don't know. It's, uh, uh, wings are good. I like burgers too. I don't yeah. know. I've kind of had, uh, recently I really, whoa, that's a big order. Um, that, Alex that, Bush, uh, by Alex the way. Bush. The man. Good guy right there. That's a guy. Dude, he hooked it up for he's, me real nice for his tournament guy. last year. It was sweet. Once you're done, Eric needs to sign that. Is Eric here? Yeah, he just walked in a second ago. I could, uh, you need to sign this harp too. Oh, sweet. James says, on the Foundation podcast, Macbeth talked about winning the 2007 Sunrise Showdown over Micah Dorius. Yep. What he didn't mention was a young A.J. Risley taking ninth at Intermediate yep. at the same tournament. I was there, yeah. <laughs> nice. I was there I was there for that one, yeah. Um, let's put that one in the uh, in the completed one there, and I'll take these over to you. But it needs, a, it needs a slip, right, so it doesn't get... It's got, it's got it under there, and I'll just drop this with it. Just what, put if, all if he, of those, put oh, that okay, with okay. all of those in there. Oh, okay. The whole order. Sorry, we're new to this. <laughs> all right, now this we got a... second in-store signing ever. Yeah. Should we take some questions? Wings, fried chicken goes with the waffle worms. Uh, I've been... I was going to say I, I like uh, honey mustard wings. I don't I, think I've ever tried those. Yeah. I, Where do you get that at? I don't even know. Like, at, I don't know. Uh, I think the last time... Well, I think I first had them in Jonesboro. There's this a place. Year? No, last year. Um, at B Dubs. That's good to go. This goes with that no, no, big order. Okay. Surprisingly enough, not at B Dubs, but that's at go. just a, another random place. But they, B Dubs, if you're listening, get on it. Honey mustard wings. Honey mustard wings. I'm gonna. Oh, is it time for the? Hi, welcome to the store. Oh, what's up? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, you're just in time for the hood. <laughs> Paul says, "Please have AJ Risley personally sign my disc." Oh, I'm glad you. Uh, I'm glad you clarified because I was going to sign for him. Mm -hmm. But since you said personally sign, we'll have him. Can you forge his signature? Uh, right. Right. No, I'm just gonna stamp my signature <laughs> on there. Okay. Lucas says, "Grady Shoe rep in CDGC. Love the fact that you're throwing the best plastic ever." That's what he said. CDGC. Ever. I guess that's a uh, Charlotte disc golf. Yes. Yep. Sweet. I did, nice. a, I I did a big sig for him. Ooh. Hashtag big sig. Please sign for my wife. She's your biggest fan. She. Wow. How'd you read? How did you? <laughs> how'd you do that though? I'm um, just. That usually just means it's a um, thing that they that the a computer didn't recognize. I'm, I'm saying a uh, a punctuation mark that I didn't recognize. Right. I know. I'm just messing with you. Well, you suck, man. Okay. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, Tim says regular McChickens, four miles walking with spice McChickens might not be good for my run. That's fair. I've never tried. Don't sleep on McChickens, that's for sure. Yeah, that's 100% true. All right. Whoa, Seth whoa, whoa. says disc request, Robert McCall's signature, Lucidex Warden with Disc Golf Answer Man, keep it real stamp. Um, I would be very interested in that, Seth, but uh, you know, they usually reserve Lucidex and OptoX discs for the people who uh, are touring disc golfers um, or world champions who have at one point been touring disc golfers. I don't really qualify under either of those criteria, but I appreciate the support. Oh, I messed up the J again. What the heck? Are we going to talk about why this trophy is right here? It's a nice trophy. Yeah, yeah. let's. Why don't you tell us why that's right there, dude? Um, you know, just hopefully it's a future reference to where it's going to go. Right oh, here. dang! Yeah. When you filled out your fantasy disc golf, you picked yeah. yourself all four times. On it? Oh, nice. oh, MPO, how interesting. Huh. Oh, sweet. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's cool. That's weird. Maybe I'll be holding that later. <laughs> how many Waffle Houses have I visited? Uh, it's, Do you keep a list? I don't, yeah, I don't keep a, like a, a list, but it's got to be, cl it's close to 50 at this point. Do you ever recognize an old Waffle House you've been to? Yes, I do. <laughs> Can I sign over your signature? He said, if you have a, uh, yeah, if AJ or any other warden loving pro 
are in they, if they could sign it. So I'll just sign right here. Is that cool? Yeah. I'm you only could, I'm only joking. You can you can sign wherever you want, guy. Okay. Um, let's see, Alex Bush. We just processed your order a second ago, Alex. You're a real one, and we respect He's you. A, yeah. Uh, he says, "Is it true? Is one even a true Riz head? Rizley's secret fan club? If you don't buy a Waffle Warden." No, is the answer. No. You're not. Do you want to sign this? It says, "It says do Warden, love, do Warden love Loving Pro." Uh, I mean, I like the judge, and the warden's just a judge without a bead. I say you sign it. It's probably important. <laughs> and while you sign it, you can look at this, that cool you M. Sure. <laughs> what? It has other items with it, and I don't want to get it and mix it up with other borders. You got it, dude. Thanks. No problem. Thanks, Jackie. Thanks, Jacqueline. Jacqueline. <clears throat> Joe says Raiders go Thanks, far, Jaqueline. give or take. That's true. Give or take what? Oh, we just said that a few times give on or, the answer, man. Give or take oh. the far part? Give or take a lot or kinda. What's up, bro? <laughs> Sorry, dude. Uh, D Word says, any plans for an RV to tour, AJ? Uh, no, s no set plans, tour. but to tour. No. Should I say to tour? To to tour. To tour. I like to tour. Yeah. Yes. Uh, nothing, nothing, um, nothing like set in stone yet. But like every time I see someone else's van and I look inside, I get a little bit more jealous. And so, uh, I, yeah, I daydream about different ways that I would customize my van or RV if I had one. So, so there's that. Sweet. Um, Tyler says, does AJ have any Waffle Wardens in his personal collection he will sell after the stream? Ooh. Or have you sold through them all already? I don't believe I have any more with me besides the one, besides the one that's in my bag that I've been throwing. In, in competition. Yes. Sorry. James says, what plastic is about equal to Innova Star Plastic, replacing Innova with Dynamic Discs? All caps. What Whoa. say you, Gary? Isn't it Fusion? I feel fusion. Like the closest. Fusion. Fusion. Especially, is fusion. The, especially the, new, the new Fusion discs mm -hmm. that are coming out. They're a little softer than the old uh, DD plastic. Mm -hmm. Like if, that? Yeah. Dude, look at this one. <laughs> That's pretty cool. If you, find, if you find Fusion Burst, Fusion Burst is the best. Uh, you see, uh, it's Hilaryuta or something like that. Nice. Close Good to one. it. Says, are there any discs that will not hit the trees? Ah, yes. This um, one. <laughs> that um, specific one. One of these days, I think we're going to have our research and development team come up with one of those. We're just not there yet. So maybe next year. Not quite there yet. Yeah. What is this? In Flight says, congrats to Grady and Paige on their engagement. Thank you. Hey. So much. Boom. You did it. I'm very lucky. Uh, how much for the waffle in your bag? Uh, how old is it? Tree fitty. It's not, yeah, uh, about tree fitty. Yeah. It's, uh, it's not that old. Just sent in an order. Thanks, guys. Thank you, Bill. We appreciate that. Uh, when will DD Store get hybrid maidens or any other premium plastics? Uh, not sure just yet, Justin. I know that uh, I know that's something that a bunch of people are looking for, but um, yeah, we don't know just yet. We don't know, just to... uh, Lauren Fish says, hey Paige. She's way over there signing stuff. She's just being famous. Of course. Hashtag champ. Champ. Here, I'll champ give this line. to Lauren from Paige. <laughs> you got it, Gary? Yep. Uh, hey Paige. Hey Paige. Hey, Paige. Uh, somebody on the chat here, Lauren, says, hey Paige. Hi. <laughs> Solid. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Is that, is that all you need from me? Gosh. Mike says, when is the new cart coming out? There's I don't know a new the cart answer to that. Out? Sometime. I looked at Bobby like he would know Thank and you. he also didn't know, so neither of us know. Ooh, I would like to request to I would like to request AJ to sign one of the Waffle Wardens. Sick. Request denied. <laughs> <Just kidding. laughs> uh ooh. That's sick. Pick the best one. Yeah, this uh this one. Can I still hear? Okay. John F. Alright, let's keep it rolling. Is hybrid yeah, warden the same depth as fusion? Yes. A little bit. The, the dome is slightly different on, on the hybrid compared to the Fusion. Yep, I just think the, the slightest bit more lift on the hybrids. But once you get to the top, they're both pretty flat. It just, it's some rise up to it. Hmm. Yes. Uh, Jay one? Hernandez says, what is this? 
This is an in-store signing here at the Dynamic Discs Retail Store in Emporia, Kansas. This with is With touring YouTube. professionals AJ Risley and Grady Shu. They both had Team Series Discs released today. AJ had the Hybrid Warden and uh, Grady had the Opto X Compass. So if they aren't sold out already, just go ahead and grab one of those. Whoa. Ask these guys to sign them. You can do it. This guy, oh, okay, that's yeah. for Emac. Yeah, set, set that with it and then we'll, uh, we'll get that taken care of. Yeah, okay. Derek um, Dad, what up? Dustin says, did anyone find my order? Anyone can sign my Red Raider. We haven't seen it yet, Dustin, Red but that Raider. doesn't mean that we have missed it entirely. We'll find out. Thanks. Lauren says, Robert shouldn't be talking so much since he'll be talking 24 seven next week. Lauren, I plan on resting up exclusively between then and between now and then. So as soon as this is over, I won't be saying any words until the players, actually the pro panel next Tuesday. So thank you for looking out for my voice. I appreciate that. Um, I mean, this seems like a good idea. Hey. So Joe says, just for giggles, Grady, Paige, and AJ should play rock, paper, scissors. Okay. Right now? Paige, come over here real quick. This, how do we, is, this seems important. How do we do three-person rock, paper, scissors? I got you. Best of three? No, I got you. Yeah. Okay, so everyone, at, we're going to do one, two, three, shoot. And on shoot, everyone hits. So and then, uh, And then if, if like... If each of you do something different, then it's all a wash. But if like two of you pick rock and one of you picks paper, paper wins, right? Okay, so that's how it's gonna go. So one, two, three, shoot. Battle. On shoot is when we're hitting it. Ready? Battle Royale. Okay. That's what she said. What? Ready? One, two, three, shoot. Okay. Oh, oh God! Paige, yes, Paige dang it! The oh, easy victory selecting oh, rock over two scissors. How did she not just do this though? Like that's a pro play. <laughs> Got her. She just goes with that quick. Ah, uh, Paige. <laughs> Derek Day in the chat. He's what's up? Did you even meet Derek when we stayed at his house for in Des Moines? I don't, uh, I don't, maybe, I don't think maybe so. Just briefly. Yeah. Hey, Derek. What's up, Derek? Thank you for joining in. Yeah. I'll well, unfortunately, okay. though, we just talked about this this morning. We will not be coming back to Des Moines this year, right. sadly. Yeah, yeah. Sure. They moved the they moved uh, the Des Moines challenge up in the schedule, and it's like right after Masters Cup. So that would be. Oh a, wow. Yeah, it's like. It's a big jump. Too much of a drive, and we're also going to be um, on the West Coast for a bunch of events, sadly. But I'll be coming through uh, Cedar Rapids for the Titan Open. When is that? I think it's know? in late June. So I might roll through Des Moines. Hmm. What other tournaments are around oh, cool. there during late June? Uh, Ledgestone. Oh, great. And and then over to Michigan for D Glow. Ooh. Great Lakes Open. D Glow. Mike says how many DD pros tour in vans? Well we got Paige and Grady. Uh and, it's Gary. Sorry. Gary okay. Shoes. Then the uh, other Paige. Page yep. Paige Pierce. Yep. Page page number two. Page Pierce. And as far as vans go, I'm pretty sure that's it. But then you've got the, the Oakleys yep, in, the RV. In, in an RV. Um, Any chance Paige can sign my ice compass next to Grady's signature? Nope. Or is that too late? Uh, I don't think. Are you handling the question? Who said that? I'm not even like. I'll do it. I'm not even looking at this stuff. Looks like my order. Thanks for signing. Sweet, Michael. Sweet. Sounds good. AJ, please sign my discs. OK. Uh, let's see. In flight. Oh yeah, we can. Um, I know which one that is. I do too. The the two compasses and the one warden. Yep. Got hey. you, man. Dude, how about that? Come sign this. Big disc. sig. Hashtag big sig. Uh, Mike says, Robert, do you remember your new hair product name? Mike, I do. Um, so here's here's a long story to arrive at the place that we are now. For the longest time, I used casual hair clay, and it was the best product that there ever was by Dollar Shave go. Club. And if they ever come back out with it, I will certainly buy it again. But there's a global shortage of one of the ingredients which is the worst for me. So I tried some other stuff. It was just fine. It didn't work great. And my boy Carlos, who cuts my hair, ordered me some new hair product out of the goodness of his heart for me to try. And it's called Maverick. What? Sick. No way. Um, by Mitch is what it says. Maverick. So if you haven't checked it out, it doesn't have all the vowels in it. It's just M-V-R-C-K. Um, check it out. It's actually been very good. It held up actually really nicely in the wind today. 
Um, that, which was the first real win test, so there you go. Anyway. No, See? Stop it. Okay. <laughs> Somebody cares, Bobby. I got, I got Bobby with that one. Oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, what up, AJ? You coming to the San Francisco Open in May? Yes. Gary? I'll be there. Yes. SFO? Yes. Paige? She gave a thumbs up. SFO? Um, Adam Smith says, meaning Apex only. I, I didn't see the first part of your question, Adam, so if you drop that back in there, we can answer any and all Apex questions. I'd call myself an expert at it, but also not an expert at all. Let's see. I'm getting a special call from Zach Mountain right now. Oh, yeah, you might, you might as well pick that up. That's pretty important. Is it a, fa a FaceTime? FaceTime. Yep. Hey, Zach, we're on. Hey, Zach. We're on freaking, we're on live, man. Come on. We're live. Yeah. Uh, we're live. Uh, we're live. We're live, man. Hey, call, call back later when we're not live, okay, man? <laughs> no, don't. You should be. Yeah. I'm sorry. I just try to keep in touch with some of my friends. Yeah, that's know, okay. People I don't see that often. Hey, Zach. Hey, Zach. Call back later, okay, man? You look great, though. Call who back? Gary, not me. Never call me. Call you right now? Call me now, yeah. That's what I meant to say. Hey, AJ, you wouldn't mind signing this enforcer, would you? Hey. I would not. All right. All right. I guess Robert doesn't want me to talk to you right now. Are you going to let Robert tell you what to do? He's my boss. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> kind of. Thank you. Okay. Turn it, turn it towards Robert. Okay. <laughs> I will boss whomever I want around, whenever I want. Wow, to. dude, grammar on point. Oh, okay. Oh, and he, hung he's, oh, he, he hung up, Bobby. <laughs> he's being rude. Wait, Zach hung up? Dang. I know. Um, how do these waffle wardens compare to base plastic wardens? Uh, base as in, let's go with classic blend. These ones have a little bit more dome. Classic blend wardens are very flat, almost, I don't want to say puddle top, but they're very flat. Um, so these have a little bit more dome. The, the hybrid wardens take a little bit longer to, to, uh, to beat in. So they'll stay truer to their original flight longer than they would for a, compared to something in base plastic. Also, they're a little bit more overstable. So for right-handed backhand throwers, they're gonna fall off a little bit to the left a little quicker. Um, you can put them on Anheuser, a little bit of Anheuser with these hybrid wardens and they'll fight back to flat, almost back to a hyzer finish at the same time. Oh, I just missed a call from Zach Milton. Yeah, same here. <laughs> Dumb. Anyway. <Gosh. laughs> but Whatever. yeah, that's, that's, that's about it. Sweet. You can put a lot more power on a hybrid warden um, and exactly. it'll go You're nice and straight. Stop calling. <laughs> it'll go nice and straight with a little bit of overstable finish. Um, all right, I gotta draw a bear on the underside of that one. Okay, Ooh. probably need to set that aside then. All right, let's see. Can I see the stamp that overstable series verdict I picked up? Let's find an overstable disc real quick. It doesn't have to be that one specifically. This red one? Unless you know what it is. Nice. Yeah, let's check that out. I'll walk it up here. Here you go, Michael. I'm a little behind on comments, but there's the uh, overstable stamp. Is that framed up well enough? This is the this is the overstable stamp from Hand Eye Supply Company on your Red Sparkle Lucid Verdict, 178 grams. ASMR with AJVC. It's real good. Thank you, Gray. You're welcome. All right. Please have AJ, Eric, and Grady sign the Maverick. Thanks. Ooh. Thanks. Nice. Ooh, these are cool. Whoa, I haven't seen that stamp before. Oh, Monkey Island, dude. Oh, Monkey Island. D Ward says, do we get a Disc Smash Answer Box Man episode this week? Bobby, what do you say? Uh, we're working on it. We are working on it. <laughs> nice. Ooh. Sweet. We're always working on something, but we are also working on this specifically. We are actually working on this. Caleb says the win in rock, paper, scissors was world champ luck. Ooh, got her. Got her. Do it twice or it's luck. I oh. mean, he said it, I didn't say it. Just like actual worlds, I'm just kidding. Yeah, oh, shh. Too soon. 
Shut up. Let's do it. Robert, can I request a page signature this is on the, the worst order I bear I've, as this well? Is not <laughs> like not well a if I see bear. your order, I will make sure that it's signed. If I don't, then absolutely I will not. I'm just going to draw a bunch of hair on it now, too. Hutch says, so sad that none of y'all were there when me and a buddy got Page P's van and Eric Oakley's car unstuck. I bet they would be very grateful to you for that. Um, I was here in Emporia when Paige Pierce's van got stuck once, and Matt Sedgwick, who does all of our custom stamps, got it unstuck. So next time you see him, say, hey, thank you, Matt. You're a nice guy. Hey, Matt, thank you. Even if you don't hey, mean it, because he is. Thanks. Okay. Actually, that turned out to be a not bad bear. Yeah. Derek says, anyone else have a problem uh, ordering the waffle on Dynamic nice. Disc site? Hi, that is because welcome. they are sold out, Derek. Uh, what up, they Clay? moved through extremely quickly. So. Keep an eye out for the next time that we restock those. Hey, Robert. Yes. Zach says uh, he's really sorry, and yeah. you're his favorite team manager. Thank you. And he's really sorry. Okay. He's still not back on the team, though. Ooh. Tell him he's off the team. Ouch. <clears throat> it was in Jonesboro. Guy. Please have AJ sign the wardens. Whoa. <laughs> Tim says understable hair product. I wish it was called understable. That would be awesome. But instead, it's just Maverick. Which is still pretty awesome. Still kind of consider, understable, considering the uh, the source. Okay. Still understable too. Did you name the disc after the hair product or the? Yeah, I I personally made the hair product. Okay. Made up this story about Carlos and then named it Maverick on my own. Okay. Which I respect. Uh, thank you. Um, anyway, you Steven says. Yourself? Yeah, I respect myself for what I did in that situation. I respect my decision. <clears throat> I respect most of my decisions, but uh, that one I specifically respect. Uh, <laughs> Steven says, great courses in Northeast Indiana if y'all are ever in the area. Northeast Indiana. Joey, hello Joey, says, Robert, what happened to your arm? Okay. He, sweet, Ooh. sweet tattoo, bro. I was looking for, to get a new tattoo, and I thought, what would be better than a beef jerky tattoo? So I just went ahead and got beef jerky right there on the side of my arm. Next question. What actually happened was I was going downstairs to make myself some eggs a couple mornings ago and I slipped on the first stair and slid down most of them and my arm took the brunt of that fall. Ooh. So Did you still get your eggs? I did I did make them shortly after, yes. <laughs> yes. But I was but I was instead I, I was really excited about the eggs before that and then I was just kind of kind of excited at that point because I, I, yeah. I was just so mad that I had fallen down the <laughs> stairs and that Walter was like super excited to see me. Can I get my Robert over easy please? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. Uh, Sebastian says, how did you like your time in Jacksonville during the off season Grady? What was yeah, the Grady. best restaurant you ate at? Uh, I really like Jacksonville. It was super warm most of the time. The only time it kind of wasn't fun was when it was raining like for like two or three days straight. My favorite restaurant that I had uh, anywhere, honestly, is Chick-fil-A. Woo! I definitely ate there a lot. You guys also went to IHOP, didn't you? Yes, IHOP is uh, also a, a good choice for breakfast or lunch. You know, Waffle Houses are scarce. Not in Florida. <laughs> God, come on. I hops are abundant. Okay. No comment. <laughs> Dave says, shout out to Robert. I'm loving that sick warden I won during the Team Warden giveaway. Dave, thank you for buying one of those wardens when you did. Hope you're enjoying that warden. I have a couple more special hashtag Team Wardens to give away the next time we, uh, that we make those. Team and, uh, and we're looking to, yeah, get some of those in people's hands. So I will keep you in the loop on that. Um, Mr. Darkhawk1972 says, I saw AJ signed up for Mid-America Open. Yep, Grady, I was the first one to sign up. Nice. Grady, any Boom. plans on playing the number one course in the world? Oh. Which is? Mid-America Open. Got uh, Harmony Benz is what they're talking about. Harmony Benz. Where's that? It's in Columbia, Missouri. I've never heard of it before. But you better check it out. When is it? Do you know when it is? Yeah, it's right It's right before Pro Worlds. The first weekend of oh, wow. August. Sweet. Check pretty it out. Okay. Pretty sure that's I've heard cool. it's really cool. I'll look into it for sure. Thanks for letting me know. Steven says, Zach denied. That's correct. Ouch. As, as per usual. Uh, Dustin says, I ordered one more and added the notes. Nice, Dustin. That means we will guaranteed be able to get that taken care of for you. Um, 
So we've only got a couple more discs to sign right now, but we also haven't printed some of the orders that have come in recently. So we're just going to keep answering questions for the time being, and as more orders come in, we'll be able to sign them. For you. Yeah. Justin says, if I have a special request for a particularly flat convict, is there someone I can email? Justin, if you email sales at dynamicdiscs.com, uh, Jackie or one of the uh, retail store employees can help you out with that. Matthew says, can we make a truce between Team Warden Putters and Team Marshall Throwers? I mean, who's good that throws a Marshall? Thank maybe? you. That's exactly what I'm saying. That's not true. There's a lot of people that are, but still. That's exactly what I'm saying. Okay. All right. Uh, let's oh, wait. See. I throw the Marshall too. Oh, oh wait. Yeah. Oh, dang it. Dang it. Oh, well. Okay. Well, oh, dang it. We're going to get back to you on that. Okay. Uh, Brandon says, LucidX verdict is money. Are LucidX going to be stock run? LucidX verdicts. Why are you looking at me? Are LucidX going to be stock run? Oh, no. The verdict. Sorry. That was a specific run for, you know, just the best world champ ever. So. Wow. Uh, we, there might be a chance that we make LucidX verdicts again, but LucidX as a stock run is probably no not going to happen. No. We like to save those for, um, yeah, our top touring pros to make sure that they can get supported out on the road. So that's what we use those for. Let's see. Oh, Sun Tzu Zach says, just ordered my 7th, 8th, and 9th Raider. Let's go. Yes. Dang. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Sweet. Uh, let's see. Bobby, can we watch some some disc golf? <laughs> ha! Oh, yes. okay. LucidX Trespass sold out. Mike, I'm not sure about that. If you are on the site and it won't allow you to select a wait, then usually that means it's sold out. Shout out Charlotte, North Carolina. Hey, -o. hey, Charlotte. There you go. The this is an enthusiastic shout out. The secret lies with Charlotte. Oh. <laughs> is, that, is that right? Please sign my warden. Okay. Please sign my warden. All of uh, Let's see. Jeez, geez, guy, how many do you need? Guy. $30. Correction are biofusion burst convicts or page pierce lucid convicts flatter? Um, I haven't seen a bio one in a while. I think the lucid ones are probably a little bit more flat than the bio ones, but I'm not 100% on that. Uh, you'd probably be a good one to answer this, Grady, since you've mm -hmm. been there recently. Brandon says, good courses near Pensacola. Pensacola, Florida? Yep. Uh, I guess that's not really close to Jacksonville, is it? I don't know. No, it's probably like four hours. Okay. Um, Madison Walker would know, because she's from that area. Sweet. Next time you see Madison... Yeah. Oh, there she is. Oh, no. <laughs> it's, she's not. It was a joke. Tim says, I wish I had ordered Waffle Warden and had AJ write his favorite Waffle House order on it. Oh, dang it. Next time, Tim, you'll have to do that. Matthew says, just ordered my first Raider. If it doesn't go 800 feet, I'm going to be a little upset. Mm, you might oh. be a little upset. But you also might not, though. So. But there's a chance that if you throw it twice, you won't be upset. That's about how many times it would take me to get past 800. That, that seems fair. I don't know. I don't know this. I don't know Matthew though. So, throw the Raider on the internet, Matthew. Guaranteed 800. Yep. yep. Thank you, Tim. Thank you, Tim. Roy said, "What kind of eggs did you do? How do you guys like your your eggs? Do you guys bag an egg explorer?" <laughs> uh, what I've been doing lately is making scrambled eggs with a little bit of steak. Mm. It's been fantastic. Mm. fantastic. I've enjoyed myself immensely, other than the falling down the stairs part. Right. Um, how do you guys like your eggs? Bobby says Bobby over easy. Bobby says over easy. Yeah. I like them over easy as well. Basted on, on is pretty of, good. <laughs> basted? Basted. How do, what is that? It, they're basically like you crack, crack the egg into a pot of boiling water mm -hmm. and, bo and cool. cook them that way. Okay, I can dig that. Yeah, when I don't have to make my own eggs, I like them scrambled. But when I do make my own, I like making breakfast sandwiches with over easy. Dude, that sounds good. Hard-boiled in my instant pot. Bobby also says hard-boiled in his instant pot. Are they instantly uh, hard-boiled? Paige, how do you take your eggs? <laughs> Paige says she doesn't like eggs, so sorry. Um, do you guys bag an egg explorer? I do. I do. I have two egg explorers, yes. I also have two. I just put an explorer in the bag. Nice. Yesterday. Dan said, Bo Bobby says he doesn't. Dan. Hi, welcome to the store. Dan says, Grady or Gary? Mm. Yes. <laughs> Ramos says, do you guys have any trick shots in your game, like under the leg putts, 360s, or signature tricks? 
Uh, I don't know about I don't know about tricks. Yeah. I mean, I. Bobby is good at not making it outside of the circle ever. That's his trick shot. Oh. He's he's never made any putts outside the circle. It's a fact. I mean, I do a lot of like lefty forehand stuff. That's about as close yeah. to trick shots as it gets. I don't want to brag, but sometimes I do putt left-handed. Oh, from inside ten feet. Dang. Inside 10 feet. <laughs> yes. <laughs> from when I'm very close to the basket. Yeah. I respect that. Um, I don't. I guess I don't really have any trick shots. I I would like to be good at just the regular shots. So. Before I introduce those trick shots, I want to make sure that I'm solid at the trick or the regular shots first. You're pretty good. So, uh, AJ writes with left hand but throws righty. Yes. Question. Yes. Talk talk about what, oh. why, why that is. Uh, because I'm left-handed. Oh, I am not left-handed. <laughs> I'm left-handed, but I uh, but I throw throw discs righty backhand. How did that happen? Uh, it was like a combination of um, playing baseball left-handed and, and hitting hitting the ball left-handed stance, and then also I kind of mimicked my dad when I was growing up, and he throws right-handed. So there you go. But oh man, I don't. I want to sign someone's disc yeah. right-handed, but at the same time, I don't. Would it be your first right-handed signature ever? Probably, yeah. That would be terrible. <laughs> Send it. What's your favorite part about your stamp? Thanks, guys. My favorite, my favorite part about this stamp is probably the syrup. Mm -hmm. The syrup that's on there, just dripping down the waffle like that. Is there butter on there? Um, no. No. Yeah. Here's the idea for a 2020 stamp. You know how some Waffle Houses have. Like the waffle, and then in the middle, it's like a little rectangle where it says Waffle House. Yeah. You could do that with your... Do that with, yeah. with something? I like that idea. Just a thought. I like it a lot. <laughs> <laughs> what other questions do we have? Um, let's see. All right. Oh, he's back. Okay, Ooh. cool. Whoa. Yeah. <sighs> we were nervous. Okay, let's see. Uh, just picked up a OptoX Compass and Raider. Can't wait to try them out. Yeet. Awesome. Bam. Tell us what shots you're using the OptoX Compass for right now, Grady. Uh, I actually use a lot, um, using for a lot of flick up shots, like anything inside like 200, maybe like a little outside, but I definitely use that a lot at Jonesboro this past week. Um, and I have, I have a clear one that I use for flicks and I have a blue one that I use for backhand. Sick. Um, that's, when we threw them out in the field today, Mm -hmm. And when I got mine earlier, I started throwing it forehand just like to test it because mm -hmm. I don't know I don't have a very good forehand. They're super good for forehands. They come out very clean yeah. like every single time. Nice and flat. They're, they're awesome. Mm -hmm. um, what is everyone's... Oh, sorry. I skipped two. If you could make your own trilogy challenge, one disc from each manufacturer, what would they be? So pick one from each and it has to have a driver, a mid-range, and a putter. What's so? What's the purpose behind the trilogy? The, I think so, well, let's put it for you. This would be like your three discs that you'd score best with. Thank you. Right. Um, Thank you. Yeah. What three discs would I score best with? Driver. Uh, let's see. I would say. Oh man. That's, I would go with Explorer. I would go. I would go Explorer, Bard, Warden. Boom. Mm. All three Bam. companies. Got them. Okay. What say um, you, Grady? Again, this guy, this guy did, same this guy. guy did two orders. Literally the exact same guy. Well, well but they're David different. David Ham, that's great, David man. Ham. Thanks, David Ham. Thanks Hamm. for supporting us and supporting sign, these guys. I'm gonna sign it. Sign it all. Um, sign my all driver orders. would have to be the Page Vickers Lucid X Getaway. Oh, get some. Yep. Dude, I that's, haven't gotten to throw one yet because they are sold out, and that's how ooh. it goes. But they seem nice and stable. I have three in my bag. Dang. If that says how good they are. Um, okay, good start. Good start. Good start. Hmm. I, I think I'll go with the OptoX Compass. Seems like a good plan. Yeah, oh, that's a know? good. That's a yeah. That's great. With my name on it. Yeah, you're gonna uh, like it. Probably the most versatile mid-range that I have in my bag right now. So that'd be pretty good for almost anything. And putter. Uh, I think you'd probably want the Shield or the Maiden or something. Is the Maiden? Uh, Maiden is pretty West shallow side? and straighter. Yeah, it is. Hmm. Um, what do you put with right now, judges? Judges. The shield's pretty similar to that, right? Ooh, uh, actually, the crown would be the crown? almost almost just like a judge. A little mm -hmm. bit more glide. I've heard a lot about the crown, actually. So yeah, I'll choose the crown They're good. for my putter. That's solid. Um, I would do a... Oh, man, this is super hard. 
Mais um X. I think I would um I think I would do the getaway for my driver so I can do lots of stuff with it. Honestly, real, like, ri real original, Robert. Yeah, sorry, dude. But anyway, uh I can do lots of stuff with it. In fact, they go nearly as far as my distance drivers if I hit them just right, which That's, is pretty cool. Yeah, that is cool. Um I have to pick the warden for my putter cuz team warden. Again, real original. Yeah. It's, I know it's surprising that All I would right. choose that. Which west side mid range are you gonna are you gonna go with? I'm gonna go with. I'm torn between the warship and the pine. The Ooh. pine is nice and overstable, uh, but the warship is like very very straight and for a mid range goes super far. Yeah. So. I felt nice. a VIP X warship yesterday for the first time. We got a bunch of them. Pretty incredible. Oh, VIP X. Nice. Yes. VIP X. Hi, welcome to the store. Okay. You're welcome. AJ right, we've, got, we've got some more of y'all's orders printing out, so if we haven't gotten to yours just yet, there's a very good chance we will here in the next little bit. But in the meantime, we're just going to continue answering questions. Should I sign the disc or the sticky? I think the sticky. Hey, get, Yo. hey. hey, get out of here. Oh, and he hung up as soon as he saw your face. <laughs> Standard, Zach. Anyway, let's let's keep it going. Tom says, AJ, greetings from Finland. Dude, dope signature, from actually. Finland? This is would probably you, one of my best put, signatures. But will you sign this, though? Yeah. Instead? Okay, thank you. Oh, wait, what? Uh, Sebastian says, what is everyone's favorite tournament footage to watch, and do you watch your own tournaments back? Yes. Depends on how good I played. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> I've yeah. seen the, the ones that I've played better at, I've seen those more than the ones I've played poorly That's at. That's true. What's your favorite one, Grady? Of, of footage of myself, or footage yeah, in general? Um, or both? I, I think he just says, what's everyone's favorite tournament footage to watch? Um, okay, so... Are we allowed to answer this one? Well, yeah. yeah. Okay. I think, I think right now, probably the 2018 FPO final round. Yeah, of course. Of the World Championships. Nice. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, it's a good one. I enjoy watching that video. Yeah, for sure. I'm gonna have to go. I'm gonna have to go with the, uh, the la 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 the. The MSDGC, Marshall Street Disc Golf Championship. If you've ever seen them, there's like a few, a few years that were put out where um, they're basically produced by, by the Dodge brothers, Steve and, Steve and Todd. Steve Dodge does the commentary, and it's, it's just a riot. Yeah, the, and the commentary is, uh, Birdie! That's, yeah. that's every... That's <laughs> Birdie! Every. Straight as a string. Yeah, that's and <laughs> Steve, Steve just throws in, throws in a multitude Birdie. of catchphrases and... The thing that he does that makes those those DVDs they're only they were only available on D DVD but he like tells a story throughout the turn the whole tournament it's like one DVD for the whole four round tournament and he does a really good job of like narrating this whole the all the storylines behind the whole tournament you know who who kind of makes their run towards the top of the leaderboard and whatnot um, and actually. If you look up, I think it's Disc Golf Network. They they just launched it on uh, Roku. He, they have all of the, all those MSDGCs and Vibram Opens in their archives. So so now if you have a Roku, you can add that channel on your Roku and watch all those old tournaments from 10, 15 years ago, and uh, relive some of the. <laughs> the vintage action. Yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty fun to watch. Yeah, that's um, super cool. Um, I like, and I like watching. I've rewatched uh, round two at the 2018 Ledgestone Insurance Open. Yeah, a few times. You're putting the old shred on it that one. Yeah, I played pretty well. It was kind of a good motivator. Shameless plug for that <laughs> round. Plug. Better check it out. <laughs> I want your signature. Um, Thanks, and I don't know Thanks, what my Emily. favorite one would be. I, uh -huh. The when I hit, when I just started here, I kept up with disc golf coverage a lot more than I'm able to now. Um, gosh, I don't know, man. I don't know if there's one that I just go back and watch over and over. Uh, I just like keeping up with the uh, the most recent ones a lot. Thank you, Scarlett. Um, so yeah, that's what I like to do. Jomez is, you can yeah. you can Jomez is you can rewatch any any Jomez Jomez tournament and be pleased. Yeah. Sweet. Noise. Um, dude, speaking of Jomez, speak of him. AJ and I are going to be doing the commentary on Jomez MPO2 for GBO all four of the rounds. So, if That's you right, want yeah. if you want more of this magical interaction, 
Uh, no. But we talked to him a little bit yesterday about how we're going to organize it. Yeah. It'll be early mornings. It won't be it won't be a lot of fun. Oh gosh, I just messed it up. <laughs> or did I? Yeah, I totally did. Team Warden. This is sick. There's three extra. Okay, let's points keep it going. There. Yes, thank you. He's helping. Uh, Grady, waffles or pancakes? Ooh. I've got a um, I've got a comment I think on that. Waffles. Grady says waffles. Yeah, in I, general I like waffles more. I also say waffles, though I eat pancakes more often. I don't know why. But that's where we're at. Oh, is that new stuff? Yeah. Yep. Hit it. Uh, we, Joey and I passed a waffle and pancake oh. house um, on our way on our way here to Emporia the other day. Waffle and pancake yes, house? Yes, that was the sign on the side of the road. Waffle and pancake house. Feels nice. Interesting. Sick. Which one would have drawn you in more? They said Pancake House oh, or Waffle God. House. I messed that one up too. Uh, what if it said Waffle House but it wasn't the Waffle House? Then I would, yeah, I would call it a liar. Yeah, that'd be, that wouldn't, that wouldn't end well. <laughs> Solo says, are they going to restock the special edition Raiders or is what's on the website going to be? Hi, it? welcome. Hello. Uh, I think what's on the website is pretty Which much going to be it. This so, one? Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, as far as special edition goes, we'll have. Plenty more stock fusion and eventually other plastics coming in as well. Um, Matthew says, anytime I go to a Waffle House now, I think of AJ. I think you need to have them sell his wardens. You need to sign that That's one. not a bad idea. Someone, it's really nice. I think we're signing all these. Whoa. Have both AJ and Grayson. Robert Emacs signature. Sure, man. Ink I got you. Ink up boys. Ink, ink, ink up those boys. Ink up those dudes. Okay. okay. Denny asks, do we need a guy stamp? Yes. Probably so. Yeah. Team Probably guy. So. Yes. Isaiah <laughs> says, looking fresh. Oh, you you want to sign it? Oh, yeah. Thanks, Isaiah. These are... Oh, hi. Welcome. These are our special... Uh, 2019 GBO hoodies. Yeah. I'm actually getting kind of warm, though, so I'm going to take this off. Now that someone finally complimented this uh, <laughs> sweatshirt. All of them? Uh, let's yep. see. Tyler I do. says, hey, what's up? Man? Good to see you. Uh, lunch next week. Okay. Let's. On me. Yes, okay. sounds good. Whoa. Um, Vash says, the, the Whataburger Dr. Pepper shake is, in Oakley terms, it's good. Um, I have not been to Whataburger in a while, and I have definitely have not had a shake there in a while, but I will check it out because you said so. In and Out is better than Whataburger. Thank you so much. Have a good day. Sorry, we were troubleshooting the GBO app. Am I doing this? Okay. Sweet. I just realized you probably couldn't hear me. I know. That's why you go go toe to it. I don't know about that, Lauren. That sounds crazy to me. Um, You're crazy. If that's my order sitting in front of Grady. This one? Yeah, whose name oh, is on it? Oh, Eric there? needs to sign the top one. Whose name is on it? His name is. Car you Riddle? Yes, it is. Can Robert, can Paige, Robert, and Bobby sign the Maverick as well? Okay. Sure thing, man. I got you. Bobby, will you come sign this, please? The evidence. Which is better, the fugitive or the evidence? No. Um, I never really got into throwing the fugitive. It was around a little before I started throwing DD stuff. Mm -hmm. um, if I had to pick today, I'd probably say the evidence. Okay. But, I, but I prefer the original truth over both of them. Hmm. The original truth is really good. <laughs> nice it is really good. Except the wardens. <laughs> okay. I got one more and then we can keep it moving. All right. All right. Let's see. D Law says AJ is the GOAT. Yup. Justin says if you were all forced to change putting putters, what putter would you use? Hmm. Pure. Really? Yeah, it's. I would say the, I would say the pure is the closest to the warden. It's kind of like a shallow warden. <laughs> is it not? Am I wrong? I'm wrong. No, that's what it is. Yeah, sure. <laughs> you jerk. Um. <laughs> Dang, that's quick. I think. Is this all? Probably this? the crown or the shield. Yeah. Yep. I like how round they both are, and they. I like. I generally like the tops of my putters to be like super flat, especially where I put my thumb. Yeah. It's so, like if there's any kind of like round like, from the outside, it's always a little uncomfortable. I feel like I have an inconsistent release with that. Sure. 
Um, if I had to change, I would probably just quit disc golf. Wow. So, no, that's not true. Um, I put it with Mercy's for uh, a little bit before Wardens, and I like those pretty well. Um, I like the Judge pretty well. Honestly, the Marshall's pretty good too. I, I would never tell Oakley that ever. Um, but it feels pretty comfortable in my hand for sure. So, and then the, the crown actually I think would be really good. Um, last one that I would be even moderately interested in checking out is one that I haven't putted yet, but I think a lot of people are going to like, and that's the guard. Uh, we just released classic guards today. It's really deep, so I'm not sure that it would be um, exactly like a warden for me. In fact, I know it wouldn't, but I know that it's a lot like it's very very straight and stays in the air a long time. So if you're having trouble hitting the cage early, I think the Guard's a great putter to try out. Gets you some extra glide and uh, yeah, it's really good. So hmm. there we go. Uh, Chaser says, "I dare Robert, AJ, and Grady to give the next customer who walks in a standing ovation." Dare okay. accepted. Yes. Hey AJ, I enjoyed watching Watch you. Watch Paige just exit. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, AJ, I enjoyed watching you at Blue Ribbon Pines for the Majestic a few years back. I've been a fan ever since. Have a great rest of your season, guys. Hey, thanks. Uh, Brandon says, we need a Lucid X Justice. It's not beefy enough. Oh my God. <laughs> You're wrong. Uh, yeah. That fair. would also kind of be hilarious. It would be. Hutch says, is hybrid more or less stable? It's usually a little bit more overstable. Yep. What is it a hybrid of? Hybrid of anything, I guess. Oh, I guess. what's is the actual the... plastic blend? Yeah. Uh -huh. I know it's a blend oh, dang, of good question. part lucid, part fusion, but I don't know the percentages. So which one is it more stable than, or which one is it less stable? Right. It's a great question. <laughs> <laughs> um, Omar says, the waffle. Yeah, Omar. <laughs> What's up? Dustin says, I'm right-handed and throw left-hand backhand, currently working on the righty. Nice. Uh, hybrid wardens are amazing. True. Yes, they Tom are. Tom says, about to hit I local course for the first time this spring tomorrow. Uh, I think Tom was saying, he maybe is the same one who said greetings from Finland earlier, so <laughs> glad that you're finally getting to get out of, well, it may still be, it may still have snow on the ground. Darkness. But, yeah, but at least getting to throw a little bit. <laughs> the darkness. Um, let's see. Justin says, I love the stamp of the Ron Converse Dimax disc. Having a wind guide on a disc is brilliant. Could we add additional molds? Um, we, I think we have that available on almost every um, Dimax mold that we have. So it's uh, it's widely available as much as we can. Five. Uh, Hutch says, Grady, Five. why did you leave pages? Zero. Okay. Uh, Gr Shut Grady, it down. Why did you leave pages card round two hole 18 at Jonesburg? Ooh, yeah. Well, I had to warm up for my round. Dang. I stayed with her as long as I could. But I needed like 30 minutes. She says no. <laughs> Round two. All right, we got, according to Bobby, we got five minutes five of them. before we shut it down. So if, shut you're it not, down. if you have a question that you need answered, drop it in the chat right now. Also, if you haven't gone to dynamicdiscs.com to order uh, our tour series discs, check those out. We also have stock stamp raiders as well as uh, classic guards as well as lots of great stuff including this sublimated hoodie. Check that out. Ooh, would you look at it? Would you just would you just look at it? They're check very out, comfortable. Check that out. If you haven't They're checked nice out dynamicdisc.com lately in preparation for the glass blown open, you need to. Look at this guy. Look at look at Charlie. Oh yeah. Yeah. You had to. All right. All right. Welcome to Woo! the show. Yeah. There you go, Chester. There you go. That one's for you, bud. All right. OK. Um, is this live live? This is live live, Ooh. as evidenced by that. that. Um, that's a negative on the guy stamp. I don't know, Danny. We'll work on it. Whatever, guy. Uh, let's see. I wondered why you all. <laughs> Dave says. Yeah. Bobby said someone stopped at Torchy's on their way to Emporia for GBO. Yes, and if you bring some to us, you will even more so win the day. So <laughs> just think about it. You will okay. win the day, all the days. Uh, I always wondered why you guys pick on Zach hey. after watching today. Now I know. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> Friggin' Zach. says, what color bio witness should I buy? Who's the I'll super get that chat. in a second. What color bio witness should I buy? Bio you witness. You sh purple. Sick. Boom. Let's get, let's get to the super chat here. The J Couch LJ super chats four ninety nine and he for says for the waffles for the waffles thanks <laughs> the J yeah. Couch we very much appreciate that waffles. man thanks for the super chat um, the yeah, waffle yeah, yeah. is here for you man bye Shane um, I just yelled sorry uh, we got can I get an oh yeah from who? Uh, don't don't read it but 
Just, yeah, go ahead. Oh, yeah. Okay, sweet. <laughs> Three. Brad says, what was the baby bag that Paige carried in Jonesboro? Baby bag. That was cadet, cadet bag, right? For what reason? You just weren't feeling it? So you just... <laughs> <laughs> right for okay so Paige basically said pa Paige said my name's Paige and I lied in and uh no she had the, <laughs> the cadet bag because it was nice and small compact the course is mainly open a lot of big distance shots so she only needed like four or five or six different discs so there because you go she only oh. has those two shots in her bag a ballista pro flex shot and Shut a jump putt from like 35 feet <laughs> Bill says the order with the boys. Boys. Have Paige sign those if possible still. Ooh. Is that still over here? Oh, oh it's, it's right, right there. Here. Paige, will you come sign these, please? Yep. For Bill. For Bill Cosgrew. Billy. Billy Boy. Alexander boys. says, sure it's been asked, but when can buyback retailers get Lucidex trespasses? Yes, uh, peace. Alexander, if they're still available right now, um, then they can get them right now. Otherwise, you will have to uh, wait until our next run. You need to sign all of these. Pardon me. Uh, Ryan says, Robert, excited for King of the Canyons. Ryan, I am 100% excited for King of the Canyons outside of the fact that I haven't gotten to play disc golf a whole lot lately. So um, in between now and then, I'm going to have to get some practice rounds in, find my putt again, find my throwing again, basically just find disc golf again. But once I do that, yes, I'm stoked to be out there. Just open your eyes and you'll find it. Yeah. <laughs> um, You're pretty good. Let's see. Uh, What's the Jomez commentary team nickname? Hmm. Whatever you want it to be. Whatever you want it to be. Yep. Uh, Brian, we don't know just yet, man. Um, we honestly haven't talked about it, but we have talked about practicing commentary to prepare ourselves for that. Um, we we have not gotten our back and forth jokes set just yet, but we will. Just kidding. I would never do that. Professionalism only. Yeah. No jokes ever. Will there be yep. black classic blend wardens ever? Ooh. Would you yes, them? yes, there are. There are black. There are there are classic blend burst wardens in like black and gray and smokiness. <laughs> They're good. You're gonna like this. They they look really good. Um, I'll try, check my Instagram story or something. I'll tr when I go back to the DC, I'll try to find those and and take a picture of that whole stack because they look sick. Compass versus verdict, feel and flight. Ooh. What say you, Grady? Um. Compass is straighter than a verdict, but for me, no oh, sorry. For what? Oh, Go ahead. Com compass is straighter. Verdict has more fade. Um, compass is probably like a little deeper and a little flatter on top. Yeah. But I think both hold up to a lot of power, so they are good for anybody. Yep. For sure. Correct. Yeah. <laughs> I, I would also say. Um, did you say the, uh, the compass is a little bit deeper? Uh, yeah, feel, it feels a little deeper. I think, yeah, just just a touch deeper than the verdict. Um, let's see, Risley hair commentary? Sure. We'll think about it. If y'all come to Big Arms on the Brazos, I'll buy you torches. Dustin, I'm so interested. Um, let me think on it. <clears throat> let's see. And still yes. Look, still looking for a couple more questions here. Uh, the J Couch LJ, after the Super after the super chat said, is it possible to see a battle of golf between the dynamic players where you lose a disc if you lose the hole? Ooh. Ooh. That would be very so exciting. You, eight, you start with 18 discs? Start with 18 discs. If you lose the hole, you lose a disc. Ooh. You don't get to use one anymore. I'm super interested. But it, so would that be like, would that be like you just don't get to use it for the rest of the round, or you throw it in the middle of the lake? Yeah, your disc is yeah, just then, then it's just, you actually have to just sacrifice gone. the disc. I like that. Excuse me, sir, we're live. Oh, uh, is this? Uh, oh, live. Eric. Oh, hey, saw, up, dude. Dude, saw. Oh, hi, Denise. Oh, hi. Eric Oakley. Na, 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 na. There you go. Hey, Eric, saw, dude. Hey, we're we're live. Anyone that's pro disc golfer can sign if on hand. We're live, we're live on 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 face on the YouTube. You want to say hi to everybody. <laughs> We'll see you in a couple hours. Mm. Do I qualify as a pro disc golfer? Okay. There's Sprout. Oh, I, I, I think you do. Hi, Sprout. Oh, Sprout. Hey, uh, oh, what's up, Sprout? Paige, will you come sign this? Oh, what's up, Maverick? Spurt? And this Raider? Oh, and then this. Uh, and then the, okay, the, the boys order. She got him. Okay. 
See you, Tina. Okay. Um, let's see. Any of you fellas heading up to the Pacific Northwest or Washington more specifically this year? Maybe not Washington, but yes, Portland area for at least two for big Beaver State and Portland Open. Yep. Yep. Sweet. All Justin of that. says we need more Paige Bierkus commentary. Make it happen, Robert. Please. I told her. I told her no. I, t I told her no thanks. Oh, there's just Paige. kidding. Oh, there when, she is. When we did commentate, you got to see her arm briefly. Uh, when yeah. we did commentate on the dynamic duel, yes, man. Um, that was very much fun. I think she did a great job. I would never say that to her face, but um, I will tell you, I think she did a great you job. Said it, you said it next to her face. It was close Does to her count? face, yeah. Utah open for any of you guys? Nope. Nope. Three nope. Three. The, the challenge at Goat Hill is that same weekend in Oceanside, California. Check it out. It's going to be covered by Central Coast and U-Disc Live. Ooh. We will have plenty of touring pros, and we will have plenty of added cash, and we'll have five USDGC spots. So... If Ooh. you're not, yeah, right. If yeah. somebody who doesn't want Come their USDGC spot, can I take it from? Them? No. Do you just transfer if you, if you beat them in the tournament. Signed, please. Okay. Yeah, here you go, Gary. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so yeah there you go. There you go. Ooh, there you clear. go, Kenan. We got these signed for you. Um, we are we are basically out of time here for the live stream. So we just want to say thank you so much for joining us for a live in-store signing session with AJ Risley, Grady Shu, and then some special guests, Paige Biricus, Eric McCabe, all those people. Oh, the specialist guests. The specialists of all Look guests. Um, if you are coming to GBO, we are so excited to have you here. Our festivities start up as early as tomorrow for uh, Flex Start C tiers and everything like that. But the full-on GBO. Yep, that's it. Flex full-on starts. GBO festivities start start on Monday. Um, Matthew says, AJ, can I have you sign my wardens when I come watch you at GBO? Yes. There you go. Uh, thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you haven't subscribed to the Dynamic Disc YouTube channel, you got to do that. We need some more subscribers and we need some people to ring that bell. So click subscribe, ring the bell so you don't miss out on content like this. Mm -hmm. This is the content. Thank you guys for tuning in. Five, we'll see you next time. Four.